<clears throat> hey, what's up, everybody? Vance here. I uh, just wanted to um, do kind of like an EDC update slash channel update. Uh, been getting a lot more subs lately, um, thanks to a bunch of people on here. Um, as I lay dying, 1984, Chosen 7x7, um, my homie Exacto, uh, Weavers of Eternity, T.S. Gear, and, um, what's that guy's name, that little dickhead, customizes knives, the Tough Thumbs, yeah, Jeff, so, <laughs> um, I guess, uh, I just want to say thanks to everybody at Subbing, uh, I really appreciate it, and I'm planning on doing a contest soon, um, to show you guys my appreciation. Um, that's what these couple things back here are. I uh, have a Columbia River. These are all brand new in the box. Crawford. Original Casper. So. That's one thing. Um. Another one I have, brand new in the box here. It's been carried, and none of these been used. Um, it's a Boker Plus, Batman Karambit. It's one of the earlier models. It doesn't have the uh, designer's name on it. Um, so that one, and. This is a Kershaw Kai Blade Trader. This is Deluxe Kit. I know I got some preppers and a lot of people are in the camping and stuff that are subbed. Uh, I bought this at a flea market. It appears to have never been used. Uh, it is missing a little pull deal on the end of the zipper. But all of these blades are cherry. Six blades. This one here, this one is a saw blade, fillet blade on the end, a chef knife, there's like a bread knife. Um, so you get all those blades, wood handles. So, you got that. These are some of the things I was thinking of for prizes. Um, like I said, I really appreciate everybody subbing. Any comments, um, questions, um, requests, uh, you know, anything that you think might help, um, you know, shoot me a message, PM, comments, um, let me know what you think, guys. Uh, so, I guess that's that. Um, but I'm, trying to get, I'm trying to figure out what I want to do for the contest. I know it's going to be a VR, you know, video response. Um, I'm just trying to figure out what I want to do it on. Um, but give me a couple weeks maybe on that. Um, it'll be coming soon. Um, and then I wanted to do a, uh, wanted to do a EDC update. Been, uh, been a while, done a lot of different stuff, so, you know, um, every day, keys, lanyard, uh, Weavers of Eternity made these, like, uh, mummy things. I use this skinnier cord that, like, I have on my bracelet here. Uh, the outer stuff, the center stuff actually has these little reflective squares all in it. It's made by Night Eyes. Both of them are. And it's pretty expensive, but um, the answer is that. I'll put my Surefire bead on there. Came with one of my knives. Uh, grandfather's dog tag. This little Benchmade sharpener on here just in case. And this uh, Spyderco bug. Uh, tough Thumbs gave me that. So keys, always have those, <clears throat> uh, cell phone, wallet, but, um, in my wallet, we have the, uh, bird, flat bird, uh, it's a credit card knife, it's actually, uh, pretty cool, uh, pretty wicked blade on it. Uh, 
is made in China as a bird knives are. It's this little frame lock here. You push your finger through the hole, and that's that. That guy's pretty cool. Um, so that's always there. Um, when I go out, um, I generally will carry this guy now. This I got a from Exacto ZTO200. Um, smooth as butter. Been using it. Uh, awesome knife. It's beefy. Um, it's a good grip. And uh, real smooth. Uh, there's a bunch of different ways you can open this. Oh man. Oh, I cannot go. There we go. Sometimes just flip your wrist hard enough and you can get it to fly open. You get the flipper, you know, thumb studs. And if you pull it out of your pocket, exactly has a video on it. Um, and you angle it out away from your body, you can catch the thumb stud and open it that way. You can do that with a lot of other knives if you try to. So you never know. Uh, try it out on some of your knives. Um, and I always carry this in my fifth pocket when I'm out. This is the Spyderco Chad Los Banos Design Lava. Um, great ergonomics. One of my favorite knives. Uh, carried a lot. And when I'm out, I always have this little micro stream <clears throat> from Streamlight. It's little, um, and it's about 28 lumens. So. These are pretty nice. Actually, comes uh, you can take the very end of the tail switch cap off. Comes with an extra rubber button in case this wears out or something happens to it. They send you with an, a replacement. Um, now, when I'm at work, uh, I go a little different. Um, when I'm at work, I'm gonna have my Surefire Delta folder on me. Uh, haven't used any <clears> of <throat> these things here for nuts and bolts, but I have a ratchet with every socket I use, uh, about 15 in the bag, so, uh, but I use the cutter, um, I use these, uh, wire cutters that are built in right there, uh, they cut up the 12 gauge wire, uh, it's got a glass punch in the end too, this goes from 13 64ths up to half inch, has flat head for the flipper, and I put a 223 shell on there, a nickel plated one, cut it down, put it on instead of the thumb disc, catches your pocket like a wave, uh, the lip there. But, um, great knife, titanium frame lock. I have videos on pretty much all of this stuff. So, um, I also got, I got this from Tough Thumbs. Uh, he hooked me up with this. This is the, uh, Gavco Wujidashi. I actually had a titanium little Boker Plus pry tool on my keychain before, but shit, fuck that thing, right? Throw that out. Uh, got this pry bar, bottle opener, and then you can uh, take it out, spin it around, stick it in there. You get your little Kardashian blade. I've been using it today at work and stuff. Uh, it's cool. But Works good, uh, great retention. I just I hang it from like my, one of my belt loops or something with this S beaner, and uh, it comes in real handy. Um, and at work, I carry the Streamlight PT2 AA. It takes two double A's, um, 110 lumens. It's got the uh, strobe setting and the low setting, so. Um, bezel for striking. It's not like real aggressive or anything. But I mean, it's, it's got enough length. You can use it a, as like a coubaton defense weapon, something like that. Um, then I've also been carrying the hell out of this guy here. And I know you guys already saw it on Tuff's channel and here on my channel. Um, but I love this knife. Surefire Echo Fixed Blade, and the Moon Glow Scales in there, Tough Thumbs did, got the sharpener and the tech lock. Um, I guess that's it. Thanks a lot. If you like the video, sub, thumbs up. See you.